Today we are going out and collecting blood samples from nestling bald eagles and analyzing that blood for environmental contaminants. Now come down a little more. The Eagle Health Project started out as a project that helps us understand the contamination levels across the uh, state of Wisconsin, um, mainly focused on the Great Lakes areas to start. So we can use uh, bald eagles as a way to understand how much contamination is in an area. Bald eagles eat a lot of the same foods that we do. They also eat both aquatic and terrestrial food sources. So they kind of give us an understanding of like what are potentially the heavy metal levels, what are the uh, PCBs or PBDEs. First, what we do is we take uh, morphological measurements. How much does the bird weigh? You know, how big is the beak? Um, how big are their talons? And these are all a good indication of kind of how healthy the bird could be. And then we draw a blood that we will then be able to do some of the contamination work on later. We can look at kind of the, the hormone aspect. Um, so we can explore different hormone levels that play a role in development. And then we can look at other hormones like cortisol, which is like a stress hormone that can be a good um, depictor of how's the animal doing. The, the reason we built such a, a unique team together is to try to tackle all of these questions from a whole bunch of different angles. We've uh, brought in somebody to look at immunological impacts. That's why we look at the, the biomonitoring impacts. We have somebody that's kind of exploring the disease side to this. And that's super helpful, especially when these projects are ex so expensive and we can kind of do 10 projects within one big project. And it's a lot of fun. 